What's going on guys, Austin here, or Luna. So, I have a story today that I hope none of you ever have to go through. And before I get into this, yes, Austin FFA was a channel. It was, I was making videos when this happened, believe it or not. Um, it wasn't recently, but like, you know, no one knew. I didn't tell anyone. I, I'm in, I was embarrassed by it a couple months ago. I was really fucking embarrassed by it. And I didn't just, I just got the courage to do this. Because like, I don't know, like I'm fucking 16, you know what I mean? Like, that's so young and I hate talking about it. But at the same time, why not talk about it and, you know, try and elaborate on some shit. So, um, I know some of you might have this already. I know some of you might already be on probation, which sucks. But the good news is, guys... If you're on it while you're a minor, good. Get it fucking out of the way. Seriously, get it out of the way and be great. Because mine didn't go on like a record or anything. I'm fine. I didn't get charged. Like everything is straight. But I'm just saying, if you're if you get it as a minor, don't sweat too much because you can just do be good. If you get probation, it, obey the rules. Don't do drugs or anything. And then when you're done, you can enjoy yourself and stuff like that. Just get it out of the way if you're on probation already. But um, I'm gonna get into this. So this sucks. I'm not gonna lie. Um, Austin FFA. It was a thing, and I was making videos, but I was embarrassed, and I didn't want to tell you guys back when that happened, so, um, if you watch the put on probation, like, almost put on probation story, it basically happened literally three weeks after that, and it sucked, because I didn't even do anything, I wasn't, I was on, like, a, I, I wasn't smoking, nothing like that, um, what happened was I got into an argument with my math teacher, and... I basically said that she was a failure, because she, she called me a failure, she said I was a fucking failure, and that I wasn't going to succeed in life, so I got pissed, and I was like, you know what, you're a failure, I'm like, you, you get paid to call us failures, how cool do you feel, lady, and I just got, I got a huge fucking argument with this teacher, because she was being a douchebag, um, and I left the room, I wasn't having it, you know, you're going to fucking, I, we pay taxes to go to your fucking school, and you're calling your students failures, you know what I mean, like that, I had no tolerance for that shit, I walked out of the room. Um, went to the principal's office, because that's the first place I thought I would get called to anyway. Go down there, and he starts bitching at me, saying the same shit that she was. And he was like, oh, you're going to get put on probation. We can do this now. Like, you've given us enough info. And I was like, you know what, man? Put me on probation. What reason do you even have that I walked out of a teacher's classroom? Like, you're going to put me on probation because of that? And he's like, no, we have other reasons. And I was like, okay. So I, I, I wasn't having it, guys. I walked out, and I just wasn't having it. So I left school. And went to the burger place across the street because I wasn't fucking having it. It's like, yeah, you know, knowing that is guys getting yelled in your face about shit that you isn't even a big deal. Like, I didn't say anything like, oh, you're a bitch, cunt, faggot, fuck you, bitch. Like, I didn't say shit like that. I just said like, you're gonna call me a failure. You're a failure, and I walked out. That's why I was. That's basically why. So I walked across the street, and the school security car came over and grabbed me. I they were like, you know, get in the car. So I just decided to obey him. I got in the car and we went back to the school. When I got back to the school, two school cops were there. They called in the second one. I don't know why. And they basically said, we're going to put you on probation. That's what the school said. And I was like, okay, sure. I thought they were joking. I thought they were trying to scare me. And that once again, I left and I didn't know, but they called my mom and my mom walked in there while I was walking out and she was like, come to the office. I was like, fuck no. And I left. And I guess when I was gone, they arranged it, and it happened. And I wasn't there when they arranged it, so I don't know what they did. But basically, I don't even know what they put it like on there, like why it was happening. But basically, I just had to... I, no one gave me any details about this. The only thing that my mom told me was, you can't do drugs, you can't smoke. All you gotta do is just sit at home all day. You're on house arrest, basically. I'm not letting you leave the house. So for three months, I couldn't do shit. I like Basically, I couldn't do anything, and... Um, I devoted a lot of that time to uh, making videos and just being a better, um, I don't know, just gaming. Um, I'm telling you guys, if you if you get put on probation, don't do drugs. Just fucking play Xbox. I'm not kidding. It's the most time-consuming, easiest way to stay off drugs. I'm not, like, no joke. Um, I just, I played a lot of Xbox. I gamed, and Austin FFA was a thing. So, yeah, I, I didn't say anything about this because it was embarrassing. And I, not Let alone if you... Like, I can't talk about that on YouTube while it's happening. Like, if I talk about something involving the police while it's actually happening, I can get in trouble. So, I don't want to, like, give any details that I shouldn't have been giving. And, yeah, it really sucked. I couldn't go anywhere. And the way it worked, actually, was I was on drug tests for three months, and I couldn't leave the house. And then the rest of the three months, I had to keep in contact with them, but I still could leave the house. So, it was really weird. It was kind of an easygoing probation, but it was still probation, which made it really shitty. But, um, I'm sorry if any of you guys have this. It sucks so bad. Um, I'm, I'm done with it now, obviously, but it just, it really sucked, and I hope I never, it, it really made me think, like, wow, like, 
it made me take a look back on what I was doing, and I was like, holy shit, man, like, relax, and um, I'm not gonna lie, it was fun, I did like going and getting in trouble a lot and doing stuff, which really sucks, um, you shouldn't do that, um, it, it was fun looking back on it, but in the moment it wasn't, and it, it wasn't worth it to get put on probation, and I'm just glad it's over, and I'm just glad I'm not like that anymore, you know what I mean, like, it really made me think hard about what I was doing, and, uh, I still kind of smoke, I don't, I don't fucking go out every day and do it, but I still kind of do, um, but, yeah, I, I just hope you guys enjoyed it, it's not that long, it's not that crazy, but I just thought I would tell you guys how it happened, I love you guys so much, leave a like if you enjoyed, leave a comment, we hit a thousand likes again, it'd be cool, um, I love you guys, peace out.